Hi everyone, this is Roy from Stay Fit Personal Training. In today's video, I'd like to talk about breaking through a weight loss plateau using LDR. I'm going to tell you what LDR is in a moment. However, by the end of this video, I want to let you know if you are having issues with weight loss plateau, we have 10 tips to cruise past weight loss plateaus. And all you need to do is contact us and we'll get that list out to you. Okay, so getting back to LDR. Imagine this, it's a hot summer day and you're really, really thirsty. So someone offers you a nice cold beverage. Mm, let's see, that would be something like a, a unsweetened iced tea with lemon. So the best sip of that unsweetened iced tea is the first sip. And the subsequent sips till it's eventually all gone. By the time you get to the bottom, it's probably not as refreshing as that initial. So the process between the very first sip and the last sip is the law of diminishing returns. So the same thing happens in a weight loss program. So if you are in fact aware that your healthy BMI should be uh, somewhere between 25 and 27 on the BMI chart and that puts you at let's say 160 pounds. So your goal is to get to 160 pounds because you want to be healthy. But you're currently at 240 pounds. So that's a difference of 80 pounds. So you say, oh my goodness, I have to lose 80 pounds. So you set out to lose 80 pounds and you want to allow for healthy weight loss so usually they say that's an average of anywhere from one to three pound weight loss per week. So you give yourself the first 12 weeks or the first three months and you're gonna lose most of your weight in the first 12 weeks. That's gonna be 40%. So 40% of that 80 pounds that you wanna lose is going to be 32 pounds. So that's 32 pounds. Now most people get discouraged because now they're not losing as much weight because the law of diminishing return sets in. So you go another three months, so now you're at six months and you only lose 27%. So that 20%, 27% is now 22 pounds. You go another three months, now you're at nine months and you only lose 20% and that's gonna put you at 16 pounds. Now you're down to your last three months, which is a total of 12 months, and you only have 13% to go, which is 10 pounds. So you see, every phase, phase one, phase two, phase three, phase four. In the first phase, after you've lost the 40%, which is 32 pounds, you start to reach a plateau and your expectations need to be adjusted because in the second phase, that's uh, the second three months, you're only going to lose 27% and that's 22 pounds. So you continue to make your changes, adjustments, etc. And now you're entering your third phase. In your third phase, you're only going to lose 20% and that's just 16 pounds. You come down to your last phase, that's the toughest. Now you're going to lose only 13%. And that's the proverbial last 10 pounds that everyone talks about that they're having trouble losing. And the last 10 pounds is because now you're closer to your healthy BMI. So the closer you are to your healthy BMI after going through the first three phase is where it's going to be toughest to lose those last 10 pounds. But don't despair because we can help you with that if you uh, just request the 10 tips to cruise past weight loss plateau. We'll be happy to send that to you. Just send us a request from the link below. Thank you very much and stay fit.